before going to watch this video we are giving a 50% off on our SharePoint crash course you can find the link below the description of this video thank you very much enjoy this video in this video let's see how to create a minimal master page in SharePoint online and when we assign that minimal uh, master page uh, for a whole uh, site we can see if, uh, some of the customizations we have made in that and uh, we will get our own design normally when we use our customized master pages okay and uh, if you apply this minimal master page to SharePoint site uh, normally the quick launch and navigation will go go off okay so let's see how to create a minimal master page and this is the basis this will be the basis for uh, creating a better uh, master pages in SharePoint to to create this uh, minimal master page uh, we need to enable SharePoint server publishing feature okay in site settings if you go you can see site collection features and you must check here SharePoint server publishing is enabled or not it's it is inactive then it's no problem and go again and check in manage site features and uh, SharePoint server publishing is activate and since it is available in both uh, manage site feature and selection uh, site collection features uh, so it's time now like uh, so after this enabling of this SharePoint server publishing feature uh, design manager will be activated here and uh, click design manager where you will see the option to create minimal master page and here go to fourth point for edit master page and click here create a minimal master page and name it as my own master page and click ok and after once it is created just download this page and open this in any of your favorite uh, already I have downloaded this and let me move it and let me like create download one more time if you so now open this in your any favorite editors I'm opening in Visual Studio code so now you can see here my own master page dot HTML here you can see all this uh, predefined code generated by the SharePoint and in every share master page there will be placeholder main this placeholder main is the area where the content will be written by the user so we can leave it blank now whatever it is here and uh, if you want to add anything uh, for the master page you can add a little uh, title or some kind of heading you can add here uh, let's see we, let's uh, we can let's we will add this uh, here this div is belongs to this section and uh, after the end of the placeholder main you can add something like one div div this this will be in every master page if you apply to if you apply if you apply so this sentence now will be appearing in all the pages if you apply this my own master page to the site so let's save this and uh, go to the site now and 
go to the site settings go to site contents and you can see site settings here and upload this modified ma minimal master page now into the master page and pay page layout section go here and uh, upload my own master page and publish it okay and publish my own master page publish this HTML when you create a master page uh, you can see like two pages came one is uh, uh, one is dot master and uh, one is HTML if you want to do any changes do it in HTML page okay click OK now let's go to the design manager and apply this master page to the whole site and let's see that that sentence will come in all pages whatever we have given edit page layouts and uh, edit master page and uh, publish and then apply design you can see assign master pages to your site based on device channel here you can view my own master page my own master page here and uh, if you click this ok now all the other design uh, which belongs to the uh, Seattle master page will go off like uh, quick launch and the navigation okay don't worry about that click ok here and now just go to the home page and let's see let's see now you can notice that the quick launch has gone and also the navigation bar is gone quick launch is gone now and let's see this sentence came in a, the, every page this will be in every page in master page apply go to the another page let's go to another pages site contents we can notice that in every page now go to the pages and click any page here check page this is a blank page and you can also notice this in every page if you can notice this because we have given this sentence in the uh, my own master page minimal okay so this is how you can uh, create a minimal master page and do some changes later then you can get an experience working in this and you can better design the master page okay thanks for watching